morning to a fair dusting of snow. So it's one of those like, is it ice, is it snow, best drive accordingly. It's basically this now until March. <laughs> it's Sunday. It's so interesting to be vlogging on a Sunday because even when I daily vlogged, I would take Sundays off. Thomas slept till 6.30, sleep update. The changes are going very well. Very proud mom. For the first time ever, I'm feeling like maybe there's some hope. I realized it's been bad sleeps for like seven years. So imagine the changes I could make. And I read another chapter and a half of Super Attractor. I really wanna get the actual copy of it because I wanna go back and take notes and like bookmark it and highlight it. It's such a wonderful book. Edited today's video that will be up later today. Showered and got ready and now we are heading to the bulk barn to go pick up some bits for gingerbread houses. Jeremy's dad and stepmom and his sister and her partner and their two youngest kids are in town again today. So there's not really much happening in town this morning. So I said, why don't you come over and we'll make gingerbread houses. Oops, just, Thomas is so dark. I was hoping you could see him. So we're heading to the bulk barn to do that. I figure you don't really need a ton of like each candy. I don't need to buy a giant bag of it. Although the dollar store, no, we're just gonna go, we're just gonna go to Bulk Barn because I'm fairly certain they'll actually have gingerbread houses as well. I'm hoping this is just a one-stop shop. Yeah, these ones. bags of candy. I just let Thomas pick so there's no rhyme nor reason and then because I'm feeling real lazy two kinds of cookie icing then I ended up just getting gingerbread men and some cookies because I figured they're traveling they're not gonna want to take a house home but maybe we could somehow figure out a way to, for them to take these home or at least eat them on their journey tomorrow or something so now just waiting for them to come I also have ample candy canes yeah this is basically just a craft with candy, which isn't that the best kind of craft? Thomas had a swimming lesson, which went really well, and now we are out and about doing a little bit of wine touring. It's always great to do when you have company. I would end the vlog here. I know this wasn't a very chatty video today, but we spent the day with Jeremy's family, as you saw. 
The gingerbread houses were fun. Thomas had a good swimming lesson. Then we did the wine tour and then we ended it with dinner at Salty's. And then we said goodbye to them because they leave in the morning. So now Thomas is upstairs. I'm just waiting to hear how the evening goes and then I will be shortly off to bed as well. So today's advent calendar is to prep for the week and also to put in some time to take care of yourself and some time for yourself. Again, I've booked spin with the hopes that I'll be able to go, so fingers crossed. And I have therapy tomorrow, so I'm real excited about that because I haven't seen her since probably the spring, I think. Um, and then I'm gonna get my nails done at some point too. So lots of, lots of little bits in there. So I hope you have booked some time for yourself. I know it's the week before Christmas and it can be really stressful and busy, but just remember that you can say no to things. You can set time away from yourself, for yourself. You can go to bed early. You can choose to not go to social stuff and really take care of yourself this week. So uh, tomorrow, which is today, if you're watching this video the day it comes out, the 16th, we're doing a um, Marathoner Monday Facebook Live in the Facebook group. There's a link always down below if you're not in the Facebook group. You can just come join us. We're gonna talk about Super Attractor, which was the uh, Mary Reads Book Club pick, and then I'm gonna announce the new read, which will take us into 2020, and I'm sure you'll have lots of questions and we'll chat about some stuff. So that'll be uh, tomorrow night at seven o'clock if you would like to join us. Usually we drink wine or some sort of beverage and I'm sure tomorrow will be no different. So thanks for watching. I'm gonna go check on Thomas because you know sometimes when your kids are just quiet and that's concerning, that's how I feel right now. So um, lace up, subscribe, become a marathoner. Life's on a sprint, it's a marathon and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.